Tell that story. Finish up with the thing again. So how big again was it inside roughly in me, me, in width and depth and the so what about, you remember? It was about it was longer underneath the ditch more, mostly. And there was vent pipes up inside the ditch and of course black thorn bushes and everything there and white thorn bushes, right? And briars as well growing on there, right? So nobody would go up there. But I say myself if I remember it's about twenty four, at least twenty four foot long. Along down along the ditch from down the along the ditch. Yeah, going south. Going south. Yeah. And 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 the height of it roughly? About seven foot, or maybe seven foot six. You can stand in there. Yeah. About a foot clear of your head. Yeah, yeah, and and how many beds? You said it was seventeen beds. Were they still there when you were yeah, there? They had rotted. They had rotted. Right. There were, the father said there were seventeen beds they had put down there. Yeah, yeah. And of course they all stayed there. Robinson, Tracy, Breen, they all stayed there. Only the top men stayed there, like secret place. Yeah, they was trusted, you see. Yeah. They were very trusted. The Devons. They wouldn't tell anything at yeah. that time to anyone else, and all grandparents, you know. Yeah. And they had the and and they had the lads garden at the end of the special company in the. Oh, they would yeah. have, yeah, yeah. The Morrises yeah. were very good. The That's, Morrises, yeah. Yeah. Frank Morris. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah all the Morrises was good, you know. Yeah. And the Pardews as well. Who does that? The Morrises came out of Belly Dial. They lived. They were all. There was ten of them, and they were born in what they called the Herd House, a herdsman's house, in about a hundred meters from the O'Brien household above. They work for the settlers. Oh yeah, but who dug out the? Did you? Did the? My father and the crowd of men, the Morrises and all them, and Perdues and all them secret men, men that wouldn't tell anything. The Perdues and the Morrises mostly, and of course, Andy Maloney as well. Yeah. He was a neighbour down the road, you know, all around there. Yeah, yeah, and um, and God, it was some, it was some setup, wasn't it? That must have been the biggest one well, they had. They took the muck out and they could put it into the sand pit in the same field, you know, and then they covered with sand. Oh yeah. Like Hide it, like Hide it, yeah. yeah. So, so, so they're dangerous times, or some men. Of course, it'd be no good today with a mobile phone, would we? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they'd be caught. Yeah. Well, anyway, you know the the thing about the escape prisoners, did I? Oh, yeah, and I have that letter, yeah. actually, yeah. Um, I must go in and get it, I, I sent that up to Orr in Dublin, my cousin, right? She was Jimmy's daughter, right? They're all 